I started out as a, a traditional medical doctor. As a matter of fact, I like people to think of me as just a regular medical doctor, a general doctor. I'm an in internist. I don't like people to think about me as an alternative medicine doctor or a holistic doctor. I just practice uh, standard old medicine except for the fact that I don't treat dietary diseases with drugs. I treat dietary diseases by fixing the diet. Uh, the way it evolved is uh, when I was a young doctor, I worked on a sugar plantation in Hawaii. And uh, during that opportunity, I had a chance to take care of first, second, third, and fourth generation Filipinos, Japanese, Chinese, and Koreans. My first generation people lived on rice and vegetables. They learned that diet in their native land. And as a result of that basic diet of starches, in other words, rice and vegetables, they were always trim. They were really healthy people. They didn't have colon cancer, breast cancer, prostate cancer, heart disease, rheumatoid arthritis, multiple sclerosis. They were hard working into their 80s and 90s. Now, after they moved to Hawaii and had their families, their kids learned a little bit more Western diet, and then the grandkids learned a fully Westernized diet. And as a result, they changed. And they changed not only what they ate, but as you would expect, they changed in their physical appearance and their health. They got fat and sick like traditional Americans. Well, I saw this. I saw the obvious impact of diet on people's health, looking through the, the, the progressive uh, generations of people. And so it gave me this big clue as to how important diet was. The next big discovery was when I looked at the scientific literature and I found out that other people had made a similar observation. People's health and the way they looked depended upon what they ate. But probably more importantly is I discovered that if you stop doing the things that make people sick, then what happens is they get well. In other words, you switch them from the rich Western diet to a starch-based diet with fruits and vegetables like the Asian consumes. And what happens is their cholesterol goes down. They lose weight. Their bowels start working. Uh, their disease problems, they go away to a large extent. Now, of course, there are some irreversible damages that people incur by eating years on an unhealthy diet. But it's amazing what kind of changes take place in people. And the reason I practice this way is because it works. And I became a doctor to help people. So why would I prescribe ineffective tools? I feed them a good diet. And I feel good about it.